Alrighty. Do you know what day it is? It's August 24th, aka the day Starbucks is releasing their um, fall drinks. Okay, okay, so we're painting the doors now, uh, the upstairs doors. So Jack came last night and did like one coat on this, this, and then this one. So I came today and I just did second coats on all those and I just did the first coat on the other. <laughs> Obviously, that's not done. Um, and they're still drying, but I really like this navyish blue color. I forget what this, what's this one called? Midnight blue. Hey, <laughs> so it's Friday now. Um, this week went pretty fast and I'm not really sure what we did. But I got some exciting things um, happening, so. <laughs> I don't know if I mentioned it, but I mentioned it a couple weeks ago that there was this bookcase that I wanted from Ikea. It's called the Billy Bookcase and they have this dark red color, which I really liked. I thought it looked really nice, like in there by like the front door. And then it was like out of stock in our Ikea and it says, and it said online like last chance to buy. Um, and it wasn't available to like ship to our zip code and I like checked the Ikea's around, not available. And so I kind of like had to give it up on it a little bit. And I found like a different like dark red like book shelf. Sorry, I have self tanner on that. That's why I look so streaky and weird. I haven't rinsed it off yet. And then I just got a text this morning because I would signed up like for like if it comes back in stock to like notify me. I got a text that it was like in stock at our Ikea. So we're going to Ikea today. I'm wearing my Ikea shirt. I always wear this shirt when we go to Ikea. It's like Ikea colors, uh, yellow and blue. Oh, look what we just got in the mail yesterday. This is exciting. This is well, Jack wanted like a, well, our house was on a doorbell. So he wanted to get, you know, just a doorbell, but also like one with like a camera, you know, so you can like see. I forget which one he was, I think it was like the UFI or however you say that brand one that he was gonna get. Like a battery operated one because there's no like wiring for like a doorbell there. Obviously because there isn't one. You know, Jack loves his Nest. <laughs> we found out that Nest was coming out with the doorbell and was like pre-order. So we ordered it in this like greenish color. And it's, yeah, it's just like a, you know, camera doorbell. Battery operated. Cute! <laughs> oh, tomorrow. Our new fridge is coming. <laughs> so this is the fridge now, right? It's fine. It's a fridge. There, so there's this fridge that, just Google, Samsung bespoke fridge. I'm like, like I saw this like a couple months ago, we found out about it and I was like, oh my gosh, like can't wait to have a house and like have that fridge. <laughs> And then now we have a house, so, and we were gonna like wait on it, because obviously like this fridge is fine. And then Jack decided to like go behind my back and buy it as a surprise. And then he told me like a day or two later, he's like, want to know a secret? And I was like, yeah. And he's like, I bought the fridge, it's coming Saturday. I was like, uh, excellent news. Part about this fridge that is different than other fridges is that you can customize the colors. So there's like panels that go on the front of the doors and you can pick like, what colors and like what combination. So they have like some different like steel finishes. Like they have like a champagne color one, navy. It's like a regular like darker like charcoal color. And then they have like glass finished doors and they have white, like light blue, light pink, and navy. Anyway, originally I kind of wanted like navy and pink or like navy white and pink. Um, but I think we decided like with, with the color navy we painted the kitchen, um, it's probably not gonna like match the navy that they have very much. So we just went with like white and pink glass. It's just like so cute. I'm like, why did it take this long for someone to create a cute fridge? Like, come on. Who knew I could be so excited about a fridge? Right? Yeah. Yeah. You have to touch it, you just open it here. Oh gosh, I think so. You really shouldn't. Oh gosh, you did it again. <laughs> ah, it's electric. Hello, okay, it's Monday now. I'm just gonna do like a couple little updates to um end the vlog. The fridge is here, so it is so cute. I love it. Let's look at the inside. We still haven't really. So there's like um a button to do like part of the store opens 
is the beverage center. And then if you just open the full door, there you go. So yeah, so there's the top and then this is freezer here. And then this one I think can be fridge or freezer as well. Looks super cute. Oh, we also painted this wall here white. So the only thing we haven't painted down here really is we stopped right there, so the stair, rest of the stairwell, and then around this. Other exciting thing, the Billy bookcase. So we got it from Ikea. It wasn't where it said it was online, like when you go to like the Ikea, like the, you know, the aisles and like the bin number that it's supposed to be in. And I was like getting real worried. I was like, oh my gosh, they don't have it. But yeah, it was just somewhere else. And we wanted to put it here on this wall, next to the front door, right? Cause, just like a nice vertical piece to put there. But there's a problem with these little um, boxes here, like an outlet and like a cable box that are sticking out. I mean, it's like the only spot that they're like that. I mean, the rest of them are like, you know, flat to the wall. So anyway, so I think we're gonna put it here because we're gonna put like our white buffet cabinet here and then we wanna put like a litter box over there on the floor. Um, but we haven't put it in yet just because I think it might be better to do it after we move. Now we have some boxes in front of it because as you can see, it's like, I don't know if it's like the floor is uneven or like the walls are uneven, but it's kind of like leaning. It looks like it's like leaning a little bit. Yeah. And if you have the doors open, it definitely like starts to tip forward. <laughs> so it definitely needs to be mounted to the wall. We were thinking at first we weren't gonna paint the stairwell ourselves, but this one's not that bad so so like the stairs down is not as bad but the stairs or i guess the stairs to the second floor is not that bad the ones to the third floor because it goes like way way up you know and also the ceiling is that same color brown for some reason so you have to get like i don't know a ladder in the stairwell to paint that i don't even know how the heck you do that but we're just gonna wait um because it's probably gonna get banged up when we move stuff up Okay, the bedroom. Well, we hung our cats, <laughs> um, which I know we probably should have waited till we had furniture in here to hang stuff. But I mean, we're like, we don't have that many things to do before we move in and we don't wanna have to like wait on all that stuff till after we move in. So we like measured the wall and I mean, we're gonna center the, wall, the bed on this wall. And so we centered those over where the bed is going to be. And then we hung these curtains. <laughs> kind of just like suddenly decided that I wanted to have curtains in here the other day. So the rods are from Ikea and I, they're actually not like up very well right now because we have to take them down because I have to get goo gone because the stickers and the rods like do not come off well. So I need goo gone to take them off. It's like a sheer one for the back. And these were actually like $5 a set at Ikea and you can cut them, which I liked because you don't have to like have them obviously because a lot of curtains are like not the right size. But then I found this pair that was, they're 84 inches, which is like almost the entire height of the wall. So that worked. They're from Society6. They're just like this like grayish, pinkish color with like a little like arch pattern on them. Um, and they probably should be ironed as well. But yeah, so it's starting to come together. I think the only other thing we really did this weekend is I got this mirror from Ikea. I was wanting it for this room and I have the small version at our apartment right now. Um, I like it because it's standing, you know, it's not like wall mounted because then you can move it around if you need to. And it was, it said at Ikea, like out of stock, you know, last chance to buy and I thought it was gone. But then I checked it in and it was in stock in our Ikea. So I jumped right on that. And I also got that little basket from Ikea just like store some like blankets and stuff in. I have a bunch of my like yoga stuff. I brought over some plant supplies, some plants. Um, oh, this is the other thing we did. Jack took apart his desk and then we brought it over in pieces and then he reassembled it. And then, oh, we also painted part of the bathroom. So these two walls, um, we didn't paint this wall because we're gonna get that light changed eventually and then we'd have to like repaint around the new light, so. And we ordered a medicine cabinet to replace the mirror with. So, this is just gonna be like this for now. All right, bye, see you next week.